Hey guys, what's up? Um, this is, uh, welcome back to the Final Fantasy 15 walkthrough part 3. I believe we are part 3. And, uh, we're gonna go ahead and continue on with this, m with, um, our next quest. What is our next quest, actually? Our next quest is the Aaron Prince. The, um, yeah. Hmm? Oh, customer. <laughs> Let's call it a day. We're just gonna call so it a day though, but me. yeah. <laughs> From two? Along with the rest area. Level six, awesome. New filter road trip? I don't know what that means. Hey, I actually like that. <laughs> Damn, this is a really good shot. <laughs> I made sure I got the regalia's good side. That's a cute little puppy. It's not a cute puppy. I'm actually gonna get that. Look at you. <laughs> Why you gotta be so photogenic? I'm actually gonna save that to you. That that's a nice shot. <laughs> let's go and start the new day and let's go continue on with whatever we have to do. Can't even do manual. I have a quest location, the area, the little whatever. Ready for more? You bet. Let's hit it. How long is it to take there again? Forgot. For our um, next story, Lady Luna Freya of Tenebrae has issued an official statement regarding the forthcoming treaty. Words cannot express the joy in my heart on receiving word of this coming peace, nor the pride I take in my betrothal playing a part in this historic moment. On this joyous occasion, some have voiced cause for concern. The fear I will be unable to fulfill my duties as Oracle. Please rest assured, my marriage will not stand in the way of my calling. You will find me in your towns and villages, as you always have, and I shall continue Bless you all. Lady Luna Freya will set forth from Tenebrae for her wedding ceremony in the coming days. Please be advised that during this time alone, her duties as Oracle will be suspended. It's in the treaty? Of course. Simple formality. One of those symbol of the peace deals. So it's more like a marriage of convenience. Her ladyship seems nevertheless amenable to the prospect. And Noctir likes the idea. <laughs> What's that? I do? Buzz off. <laughs> I love the little banters that all four of them have. That's nice. Again, I hate Luna Freya's voice. Luna Freya, hopefully if we meet her in person and not through the radio and hear her voice now, I will like it better. Maybe it won't sound as robotic and fake and forced as it is. Hey! I see the sea! I see it too. That's Golden Key. I kinda wanna go for a dip. That a big mountain behind it? No, it's an island. Nobody goes to Golden for an island, though. They go to kick back and get massages. I'm <laughs> safe with the seafood. It's famously delicious. Sounds great. Something to look forward to. Oh, being illegal. <laughs> I repeat, being illegal and a gas. Might want to stock up on potions and stuff. Nice. You're being helpful for a change. What do you mean for a change? <laughs> Again, the little banters. Let's refuel. Yeah, ten gills. That's cheap. 
Then uh. again, I'm taking Gil is pretty expensive. <sighs> I like the little things, the little animation that it does. Oh. When I burp, though. Ready to set sail. What is this? House Flu A feature on the wedding. And get a load of Lady Lunafreya's dress. That's some fancy fabric work. Bet the groom can't wait to see it on his bride to be. Uh he's not the only one. Whew. She's gonna be an absolute knockout. And the dress is bespoke, of course, and comes courtesy of one of Altitia's foremost fashion designers. <laughs> I love how they're talking about a dress. But the food's gonna be pretty damn fancy too. Eh, as long as it's something I can eat. As opposed to dissect. Ugh, royally embarrassing. Can't wait to taste some Altitian seafood. Golden I like it. For fish, too. fish sounds good. So does a balanced meal. Welcome to Golden Key. I'm afraid you're out of luck. Are we? The boats bring you here. What about them? Well, they'll not take you forth. And what's your story? I'm an impatient traveler, ready to turn ship. The ceasefire's getting us nowhere. <laughs> what's this? Some sort of souvenir? <gasps> they make those? What? No. Consider it your allowance. The huh? Yeah, and who's allowing us? A man of no consequence. Oh, I like his voice, is that bad? <laughs> I like him. I like his fashion sense, I like his voice, it reminds me of Magnus Bane. I need to stop. I need to stop closed. right now. I'm skeptical, though I won't discount the possibility. I say we go check it out for ourselves. Hello! Welcome to the Mother of Pearl. We use the freshest fish in every dish. Cool, cool. Thank you for your patronage. You are welcome for patronage. What's all this about the port closing? Out of service, indeed. Huh. Quest complete! Not a ship in sight. I feel like I want to do another one, though. So full right now. All these things are rather short quest. Oop. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, we're gonna do another one before we- I'll call it a day, because the last one was rather short, so let's go and continue on with this. According to my sources, the Empire, given strict orders not to let any vessels leave the docks of Altitia. I'm not gonna lie, he looks a little bit feminine. Wedding. Right, Prince Noctis? Name's a little bit Dino, gay. By the way. Huh. Pleasure. His voice annoys the me. The Crown Prince of Lucis, bounty hunting in his fancy car. Surely you didn't think it'd go unnoticed. At least not by this reporter. Lucky for you, this reporter has integrity. If you want to remain incognito, I'll respect your wish. In exchange for a favor. What do you want? Hey, I knew you'd come around. Let me see your map. Marked where you need to go on your map. All you gotta do is find me some rough gemstones, like this one. Do this, and your ship will come in. Don't, and the papers will run you out of town. Capiche? What's all this about the port closing? So I'm not gonna lie, people are gonna offend me. 
I feel I feel the hate comments, but he he looks like he could be gay. His voice is annoying. I wouldn't call it a gay voice, but he is feminine. Feminine. He is feminine. Feminine. He is feminine. Sorry, I can never say that word right. He is feminine, and but not. Oh, it's a little kitty. Hello. Hey, buddy. Oh, hello. What's up? Taking a little stroll. How come you're all alone? You must be hungry. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's what I thought. Hold on a sec. I'll find you something. Oh, so gotta come up with some cat food. Could always buy some. Or we could fish for some. Excellent idea. Let's go. Okay. I got this. It's so adorable and cute. I like kitties. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh. Hey, let's go ahead and finish this quest. Um, we're gonna do this before we finish off with Kitty's quest. Oh, cute little couple. Mind reminds me of Snow and Sarah. I need to stop. I need to live in the moment and stop comparing Final Fantasy and everything. I need, I need to stop. Quite refreshing. Didn't think I'd enjoy the seaside this much. Well, it sounds like it's made a good first impression. Auto. Quest location. What's the forecast? Clear skies with the temperature rising. Nice. Optimism sounds like it could be part of an anime. Maybe Sid was right about your lack of dignity. You're one step what the delivery boy. The royal rank carries little weight outside the ground city. Glad it's not weighing me down. It is 10 a.m. in the morning. I'm pretty sure we can make it back before nighttime. Oh. What is this? Oh. Hey there, pretty boy with your... I, I don't know where he is from. From an anime of some sort. Prompto, prompto, my favorite guy. And dang that view though. <clears throat> I need to stop. <laughs> um. We can shop for stuff. You sure we're in the right spot? According to the map. Let's scope it out. Yes, yes, yes. We shall. Let's see what is over here. Ooh, gems. This will make a fine paint. <laughs> oh, what the? She... <sighs> We're supposed to get near that thing. Pipe down before you wake it up. That is such a nice view, though. Eyes are open. I can't tell if its eyes are open or not. Oh my god, its tail! Can I get near its tail? Stop your freaking breathing, mate. How majestic it is. This is my spirit animal, whatever this is. Shit. 
There's freaking Gladius over there. Just what is this Gladius even doing? That is majestic AF right there. It's shame that I fell off. What a shame that I fell off, however. That was a wonderful view right there. That is definitely my spirit animal. <laughs> suicide. Suicide. Kill me. Go ahead. I guess it doesn't allow suicide. Whatever, I'm not salty. Let's drive back, it's 12 in the afternoon. Enough time to go and catch Kitty some food. Uh, two minutes. Oh, did I fast travel? I didn't mean to fast travel. Ability points, I already read all this blah 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 stuff. What is that place? Um, I don't remember much from the demo, to be honest. I don't remember if I saw this or not. Here we are. Nice. It still basically took two minutes to think about it, so... Whatever. I don't care. Let's go talk to that guy. Oh, we still need a toxic kitty too. We need to catch some food for her. I also need to go- I also want to go exploring. Oop. Palm trees. Nice. Key. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. This is my second account. I have actually three accounts that I use, and this is my uh, my first account is I'm not gonna say my main account is um Imperium Moon. I'm just gonna whatever. My first account is Imperium Moon zero zero fifty two, and I have played. I have a past this part. I have been playing quite a lot Imperium Moon zero fifty two, but. Before I talk to this guy, but my plan is once I get to the part um, where I left off with the, with uh, my other account, I'm gonna go switch to that account. And yeah, because I do have two accounts, and on my main account, I already played a little bit of Final Fantasy V. I may or may not already know what I'm doing with this nice all. Work, kid. Sorry for still. giving you such a hard time. I just had to get my hands on this, even if it meant blackmail. You understand, don't you? No. You see, I'm a reporter by day and an amateur no jeweler by night. This elusive little beauty is gonna become a masterpiece. To make it up to you, I'll share a little scoop. That special coin you got? It commemorates the Oracle's ascension. That guy was tossing them out to everyone. Must have picked them up back in Niflheim. And speaking of freebies, here's one from me. Come back if you want to buy more. I doubt a souvenir like that could make its way into the hands of an ordinary citizen. Oh well, it's our pocket change now. Let's learn from history and book a place this time. Actually, I'm trying to get this blanket. Blanket. But damn it. As, As you know, promised, to get you. I'm in the process of securing your ferry tickets right now. Told you, I'm a man of integrity. Should be smooth cool. sailing from here. So let me know when you're ready to ship out. I admit, I His hair is nice, though. Ship. Well, must be pretty connected if he can pull some strings around an imperial embargo. Yeah, that guy's one artful artisan. Oh, we still need to catch kitty food.
Get in the way. Get in the way. Ruin the family time. Feels nice here. the deep blue sea not really I'm gonna sell some stuff always a pleasure sure is let's go ahead and fish some nice? stuff and get food for the fishy it. but let's fish like a kid <laughs> toy shop I wonder what's the story behind why Noctis likes fishing. Tension is over here. Tension is just everywhere now, isn't it? Reel it in, reel it in. Right. It's so close. It's there we go. <gasps> Yay, Kitty gets food. Great job, knocked. This sickening. Rip all the vegans out there, right? Let's stop fishing and let's actually give it to Kitty. And once we rest up, we'll call it a day. I'm pretty sure there's a haven somewhere over there. Yeah, there is a haven somewhere over there. So once we give this to Kitty, we'll call this a day. And whatnot. Music though, so relaxing. <sighs> Man, it's hot. Then lose the jacket. Absolutely. Let's do a quest. Nope. Pretty breathtaking. Yes. We passed Kitty. I forgot we had to, we had to talk to her. It's seventeen. So 5 p.m. I'm not used to counting you time know, like that. Thought fresh. <sighs> what? You don't like fish? No. Oh, you only like cooked fish. <laughs> Mother of pearl. SpongeBob. <laughs> Welcome to Golden Key. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Glad to be back. Allow me to take your order. All too expensive. We 
we'd appreciate help with these troublemakers. <clears throat> hey, do you serve anything a cat might like? That the best pickup line you've got? What? No, I... <laughs> He's married. There's this cat over there. <laughs> I'm only teasing. I have a feeling I know the feline you've got in mind. Let me whip something up. Paying customers come first, though, and someone just ordered the last fish on hand. Would you mind catching another one of these while I make their meal? No. I'm the goddamn prince, alright? So. You better freaking make my meal. Great! I'll start on it right away. You know, this is really thoughtful of you, but be warned. Cats are clingy, and they're notoriously picky eaters, too. Picky eaters? You don't say. When it comes to food, felines are quite finicky. So you are wise to entrust the cooking to me, here. Aren't you? Pity. Shut up. I don't like really. I don't really like fancy fish. I actually quite like the um. I just like plain, kind of just fried. All right. Oh, here you go. Grilled fish or oh, the occasional steamed. You're one spoiled cat. Aww. I think he likes you. I guess. Clawed his way into a heart. Might keep <laughs> clinging. Forever. <laughs> the cheesy pickup lines, I can't. Welcome Let's to Golden Key. To, do you know? You guys ready to set sail? Already? The ship won't arrive till tomorrow. How about you find a place to spend the night? Okay. It's bedtime. Cool. What the? <laughs> There's too many pictures of me and Ignis. that a day.
Hey, uh, morning. Where's Specs? Should be back any minute now. What's that look for? It's in all the papers. What is? Insomnia... false. What? Is this your idea of a joke? I need you to calm down so I can explain. I'm as calm as I'm gonna get! There was an attack. The Imperial Army has taken the Crown City. As treaty room tempers flared, blast lit the night sky. When the smoke about the Citadel had cleared, the King was found dead. No, wait. Hold on. We had no way of knowing. What? Knowing what? That the signing was last night. That insomnia. But the wedding! Altitia! I know. That was the plan. Yet the reports of the invasion are all the same. How could every headline in the kingdom be wrong? <sighs> Lies. Hmm. If only. <sighs> what else do we know? Well, then we can't be sure until we see it with our own eyes. And that means we go back to Insomnia. Might not be safe for us there. Might not be safe for us here. Turn back. Yeah. Even though I already watched that, it still breaks my heart to watch that scene go down. Oh my goodness. That hurts tremendously. But... This is what he's gonna done. Any no, we're gonna end it now. Anyway, that is it for walkthrough number three, I believe. Yes, number three. If you like this video, give this <laughs> give it a thumbs up. And if you want more videos like this, also hit that subscribe button. And until next time, you beautiful bastard.